What up, old souls fam? How's it going? It's been a hot minute since I made a little vlog ski, but uh, I got something pretty cool. At least I think it's gonna be cool. I'm not sure yet, but it is for the Del Sol. Um, let me just show you guys, cause I like it and I think it's gonna be dope, but I just don't know yet. Okay. Okay, so I have this aftermarket grill for the Del Sol. It is for my 92 to 95 bumper, you know, right here. Um, this is it. It's pretty nice. It matches my car and whatnot, so that's cool. And it gets rid of this ugliness that was in here that I don't like. Um, but I always wanted to make it look like it was an old souls grill. I wasn't sure how I was going to do that, but I hit up JR Built or Junior Built on Instagram because the dude is a stud. Um, and I was like, bro, I need you to 3D print me some old souls decals or emblems or badges or something. And this is what he came up with. It's pretty dope. So he came up with four different versions of my logo and he 3D printed them. How fucking badass is that? That guy's so cool. I just, I don't know. I love people who can make me stuff with machines and technology that I don't have that I wish I could have, but he did it. And I got some other ones, but I'm already using them for something else. I might show you guys that sometime, but they were black, okay? And I have already sprayed the fronts to be white because we're gonna color these to look like a, or to look like my logo, kind of, but I want them to match other stuff on my car, and I'll show you. So I want to match, oh geez, my wife's got plants everywhere. Good, I don't even know where to put these. God, good Lord. You get anything on here? Get out, just get off of here. Ugh. Okay, back to this. So I want to paint these to match my Type R emblems, you know? I've got this whole like red, and green and silver kind of thing going on with the Del Sol. It all kind of goes well, the red LEDs up there. I still haven't, God, I just, I got stuff everywhere. But I also got these side markers that are red. So I've got like a whole green and red and silver kind of a thing going on. So that's what I want to do with those. So my buddy Kev, Lul's Kev, you know, uh, he told me to go to the hobby store and buy some paint. So I bought some metallic red. Ooh, not very expensive though. Two bucks. Some metallic silver. I don't know what the color of this is. I don't know, whatever. It's metallic silver. It's fine. But I bought that and I bought white just to, it's like a metallic kind of a uh, pearl white, kind of a fancy white. But I wanna get these on here with this. So that's what we're doing today because this one, I think that's the one I wanna use. They're a little different. Um, yeah. So this one, I want to put on the driver's side front of this grill insert. I wanna put it, there's this thing here from the manufacturer that I don't like. So we're gonna pop this off, just like that. Once I'm done painting this, that's gonna go like somewhere right in here. And man, I think that's gonna look fucking super, super, super dope. I think at least. I don't really know, guys. 
and gals, you know. Um, just another one of my crazy ideas that uh, I'm not sure if it's going to work out, but it might. So let's get into painting this thing. I love to paint stuff, just whatever it is. I don't fucking care. Um, let's just paint it. I'm going to paint it. All I got left to do is I just have to clear it. So, because I don't want any of this to get uh, rock chipped, which maybe it still will, and we'll see. But, man, whew, it has taken me a hot minute to get this done. Like, that was like four or five coats of the model paint, and I'm finally getting to clear, but I'm just going to take some... You pull clear here, which uh, is really good clear. And that's what I'm gonna hit it with. Smoking gun is a four letter word, I hope it hurts. Love is a fatal flaw, is a broken jaw, is a burning bridge. Move your carrots. All right, so here it is all nice and cleared. Uh, it's not 100% amazing, but I think from like way far away when I'm driving, like you're not going to see it. Like you'd have to get real up close to be like, oh, geez, this guy did a real shit job. But remember, they were black and I got it to this. So that's pretty dope. And it's going to match the Type R emblem, which I have. I don't know where I had it. Oh, here it is. So, I think I got it all right. This is quite a bit more uh, chrome shiny, but I don't want this on the front of my car. I just have one of these on the rear of my car. So, I think this will look all right. Um, for mock up purposes, because I think I'm going to eventually do some Gorilla Glue gel, which is that super, super like heavy duty stuff. But for right now, I'm just gonna use some double-sided tape just to mock it up here to see if I even like it. Cause if I don't like it, this whole thing was a waste of money and a lot of hours, but I think it's gonna look all right, so. Blame. if this is even going to stay or not, but it might. But see here, it's really going to be hidden. Like it might have to go up here. Don't want it in the middle because that just looks goofy. So I might try it like right fucking like right there. And We'll just fucking stick it on there. Oh, man. God. It looks pretty fucking tits. It looks pretty tits to me, boys. Damn. It just, it's just kind of one of those things that I was so excited about to have made and then it took forever to paint. And now that it's on, like, man, that looks pretty cool. It looks pretty cool right down there, you know? Like, it's not super, like, I don't know, yeah. It looks pretty sweet, I think. I like it. I like it a lot, actually. It's pretty dope. Pretty, pretty dope. Huh. <laughs> oh, yeah. 
yeah, I do, I do like it. Um, okay, okay. All right, so what I'm gonna do now is I, is I don't want this thing on here, which said grill craft, cause this is what this is right here. This is an aftermarket thing. So I'm gonna remove that, which is just these little dealy bobbers right here. And I originally wanted this guy like down here, but you can see that how this thing works is it angles in like this rather than just like down like this. So when I had this down here, it like hid half of it and you couldn't really see it. So it's just gonna go here, but fuck. That looks pretty dope guys. I do like it. I do like it quite a bit. Just adds a little uh, personalization to my Del Sol. So that's pretty dope. This is kind of my old souls Del Sol here. I just kind of have, you know, whatever hidden all over the place. And I got that trunk emblem where the Del Sol CRX, you know, whatever kind of logos usually go, or I don't know, it might go here. Actually, I think it goes here, but I made one that says old souls. So whenever I get this, wet sanded and buffed out, which I fucking still have to do. It's gonna go there. So it's kind of going with my whole kind of old souls theme here, but that was a pretty dope little project that I had forever. Just never got time, but now I have time and uh, I got it done. Thank you, thank you, thank you to Junior Built on Instagram. That guy made those for me. Um, and they turned out awesome. Super legit, super happy with those. And yeah, whew. Till next time, guys. Um, I think my next vlog is I gotta get all of these liners all cleaned up and on my car, cause I don't have any of these things. I just have holes everywhere. And I don't have these either, so those will be good to get in there, even though, I don't know, you, you, you don't really need them, but I just wanna throw them on there cause they're OEM and they should be on there, so. All right guys, till next time, peace. Too goddamn tired to sleep.